Hey everyone, it is Sam Fiorella and I am back for, with another Mental Health Monday tip. This week's tip is inspired by a friend of mine, Jeannie Walters. And at dinner last week, Jeannie told me about a, a happiness jar that she and her family keep in their house. And the idea is when something happy or positive happens to them, they write it down on a piece of paper and drop it in the happiness jar. And then at the end of the year, on New Year's Day, they read all of those happy notes uh, throughout the year. A great way to remind yourself and remind everybody of all that we're blessed to have around us. So I did a little bit of research on this because I thought, what a great way for students to create positive mental uh, health habits, as well as for students who are suffering with some form of mental health concern to be reminded that there is positivity even on the darkest days. Students uh, naturally are uh, stressed out every day with exams, assignments, work pressure, social pressures, living away from home and the loneliness that comes with that. There's a tendency uh, and a habit that is formed around negativity. We already have a tendency to focus on the negative as opposed to the positive, but negativity has a way of drowning out that positivity, especially if we don't look for it and in this case, document it. And so I, the research that I did found some real evidence of the net positive effects of such a tool uh, for those who are suffering with mental health. And so I want to encourage every student to, whether you do it as a group in your dorm uh, or by yourself uh, at your home or in your apartment, every day, whether you wait to the end of the day or as something happens, write it down. Keep yellow sticky notes with you. Um, you know, keep it in your bag, keep it on your phone. And as something positive happens or you notice something positive, not only in your life, but in those of your friends, write it down. Drop it into the jar. I think the mere act of seeing all of those positive notes and positive experiences piling up inside of a jar is a great visual reminder to you that there is positivity in your life and there is something to look forward to every day. The other thing I like about this is that you don't necessarily have to wait to the end of the year to read it. If you ever feel like you need something positive with you that day, go through the jar, read some of the notes. And if there's one that's particularly meaningful to you that day, take it out, stick it on your phone, stick it in your book and carry it with you that day. And then put it back at the end of the day or the end of the class uh, and maybe add another note with something that's been positive. This helps you also look for the positivity every day, which again is very um, uh, action oriented as opposed to reactionary. So that's our tip for you this week. The happiness jar, great way to focus on the positivity in your life. Now follow our blog. Um, we do have a lot more details about the happiness jar and how you can set one up for yourself and some of the research that we found. Uh, but until next week, when we come back with another Mental Health Monday tip, have a positive, mentally healthy week.